The Wheat Sheaf Shopping Centre closure has had a great impact on Rochdale locals. Since they reopened after the first lockdown, footfall has been 45% down year on year. I went to, to locals to see their thoughts on this. Yes, it really is a shame. After all, you know, he's, and he's, worked, he's been here for years and years as George and the farm, you know. Yeah, I mean, I used to work in the Wheat Sheaf Centre years ago and it was a busy, thriving place to be but they put the rates up and stuff like that and obviously people couldn't afford to stay in there but to close it down via email overnight I think it's just wrong what they've done with the traders. Well a lot of people losing the business yeah it was half empty anywhere but you know still people in there. Rochdale's getting like a ghost town mm. it's, it needs to stop and it needs to get sorted once and for all. And how do you feel about the closure of the wheat sheaf? I can't go to my makeup shop. <laughs> That's the only thing I'm bothered by in the week she's sent. <laughs> Property owner said when the change in shopping habits collides with reduced income and excess of space and cost structures that are simply no longer realistic, landlords have to take action. We understand the impact on the closure of the week she's shopping centre will have impact on the tenants and will assist them where possible in this difficult time. That's all we have for today's programme. You can find us across social media on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter and TikTok at Keys News. We will be back next week with another programme. Until then, goodbye. Goodbye.